So every year Sam picks out our Halloween costumes and I have no say in the matter. I've been a different Disney prince every single year for the last five years. Uh, I find it kind of funny that I walk up to the camera and sit down before every vlog. Like I didn't have to turn the camera on, walk away and then walk back, but I like it. So I have a really good friend named Kenny who lives really far away, but he's coming to visit this weekend and I'm seeing him for the first time in like two years. And it got me thinking about my friends, like my really, really good friends. And when I see them, which isn't often because they all live far away, it's like we go back in time and we snap right back into it. It's not awkward. We know exactly what to say. We're joking around just like we were five, six years ago in college. I don't really know my point about it, but I think I'm just excited to see my friend. Oh, oh by the way, I see Kenny like once every other year, so I think this weekend I might ask him to be one of my groomsmen, because if I don't ask him this weekend, I don't know when I'll see him next. So I've known this guy for close to 10, probably more than 10 years now, drove six hours just to see me and Steve. Okay. Uh, <laughs> How you doing? I'm good. Nice to see you. Okay, so I do a weekly segment on my vlog called the Weekly Kitchen Update. So, Kenny, you have to say this is the official Weekly Kitchen Update. This is the official Weekly Kitchen Update? <laughs> that was the Weekly Kitchen Update. So we only had expired creamer, but Kenny was fine with drinking it. So if he gets sick, it's totally my fault. Come downstairs, sit on the chair and close your eyes. I'll see you in a minute. I need to dry my hair and put my belt on and socks. No time for putting belts on, it's a surprise. All right. You can put your belt on. I got these two really nice balloons oh, for nice. you. And I would like to ask you to be one of my groomsmen in my wedding. Oh, wow. Thank you, man. These are actually uh, Sam's for her bridesmaids, but I figured uh, I'd give it to you for now. He said yes. <laughs> All right, now give me the balloons back there for Sam. <laughs> Sam, here's your balloons back. All right, so I forgot to check my mail this entire week, and now I have like 9 million packages. But anyway, Kenny's going over to hang out with my friend Steve because Sam and I are going to check out more wedding venues. I'm hoping we find our wedding venue soon. I also need to get a box cutter. So we just left. Believe it or not, we're actually going to another wedding venue now. I think that'll be like the sixth or seventh one we found. If you guys have gone back and watched all my vlogs, let me know in the comments which one's your favorite. I still think last week's was my favorite one so far. All right, we're finally done for the day with wedding venues. I'm heading over to Steve's house to hang out with him and Kenny. Every year before Halloween, we watch this silly movie called Keenan and Kel, Two Heads Are Better Than None. It's such an obscure movie. It's not even on Netflix. We have to find some crazy video on YouTube to watch it. But I love the movie and we've been doing it for 20 years. <laughs>
Kenny a question earlier today. You guys probably saw it in the vlog. And I got these guys a gift from Steve's refrigerator. I want you two to be groomsmen in my wedding. Oh, wow. That's <laughs> Oh, it's just gonna be the grapes. That's yeah. funny. Yeah. Got a hot right, right. Thank you. I love that movie so much, guys. But anyway, I'm racing back home because I just realized I had such a busy day. I don't have a video ready for tomorrow on my channel, so I gotta go home and record a video now. It's like seven o'clock at night. It's always so fun hanging out with my old friends. I can't believe Kenny's leaving already. This weekend flew by, but Sam and I still have a lot of things planned. We're going to be carving pumpkins. We're going to be going to like a Halloween store to pick out our costume. I don't know what she has planned for us, but it's going to be fun. <music> So we picked out our pumpkins for carving. We got our Halloween costumes. Yes, I'm 28 years old and I still dress up for Halloween every year. Alright, let me know in the comments, which of the two pumpkin carvings was your favorite? The one on the left was mine. But anyway, every single year after we carve pumpkins, I save all the pumpkin seeds and I roast them in the oven. They're actually pretty tasty. Brandon, wait for it to cool, you're gonna burn yourself. Ah, son of a bitch. So every year, Sam picks out our Halloween costumes, and I have no say in the matter. I've been a different Disney prince every single year for the last five years. But this year, she promises that I'll like it. My friends still want to be in my wedding after seeing this. It'll be a miracle. 